I heard old Biscuity Boyle was down there, I know. Aye. <laughs> Aye. He got stuck in the revolving door and his trousers fell down. <laughs> <laughs> Poor old bugger. <laughs> Hey! Don't dingy as your pair of rent boys, man! <laughs> Keep on, Gordo. Yous are getting knifed, man! to imagine throwing a two-litre bottle of ginger over 150 metres and landing it dead centre on a target. That target being a rocket snapper. That's exactly what my next guest did, Gordon Belford. Gordon, hello. Hello, Sarah. So, what's the script with this ginger throwing thing then? Well, me and my mate Jamie were just out getting some swaggers and <laughs> on the way back, these wee guys started gaining us a bit of snash. What kind of snash? Uh, just kind of calling us bench shots and rent boys and that. <laughs> uh, and then one of the wee scalpers said that he was pulling a knife. So I, I just flung my bottle of ginger and, as fortune had, I, I doofed it right off his dome. Amazing. <laughs> and is it true you're going to be in the Guinness Book of Records? Well, apparently I'd have to recreate the throw under Guinness conditions. Gordon, you have your two litre bottle of ginger. <laughs> the wee fod is in position. He's an organ knife man. <laughs> Gordon, good luck. I heard old Biscuity Boyle was doing there and all. Aye, he got stuck in the revolving doors and his trousers fell doom. <laughs> Poor old bugger. Hey, a couple of bench shots, man. We tadgers. Hey, don't ding us, you're, you're right, boys. Keep walking, Gordo. No, baby. Us decent folk don't need to stand for no more of this bullshit, baby. You're are getting knifed, man. <laughs> <laughs> no one can withstand my two-liter bottle of ginger, bitch. <laughs> you want some, baby? You get him, Gordo. Come on. What do you think, Gordo? You never had him for here. He can't even throw a 